So have you ever taken that perfect photo outside only to get back to your computer and it's slightly out of focus? Well, if you're anything like me, it happens all the time and I'm very sorry for your loss. Until now, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to sharpen those out of focus photos with this secret extension in Luminar Neo coming up. Hey, what's up guys? My name's David Johnson. On this channel, I help you improve your landscape photography with tools like this in post-processing as well as in the field. So if you're into that, go ahead and subscribe to this channel and ring the notification bell as well for new video updates. Now let's jump right into this. As you can see on my screen, I have this beautifully lit photo from Death Valley National Park that I love to get in the field, but it's honestly haunted me for the last year. Why? Because it's slightly out of focus. Would I love to have this in focus? Absolutely, but it's just not. So if I zoom in here, you can easily see that it is slightly blurry and soft. I can use this for things like social media, that's fine, but if I were to ever print this, it would be very obvious that it's out of focus. And I haven't had the right tools to fix it until now. Now there are other software fixes out there that I am very aware of, but I didn't want to buy another one. I already had Luminar Neo and I knew their sharpening tool was coming out. So what I did was I went ahead and bought this extension. If you click on extras in the top right section of your screen, you can see all the extensions that you have available to you. Now I bought the super sharp extension. I am going to buy all of these after seeing how well this one works. And if you haven't bought it yet, you see how well it works and you want it for your own photography. I have a link to buy that with a discount in the video description as well as in the pinned comment, so check that out. Now let's see how this works firsthand. So I'm going to go in here to edit, and when I pull it up in edit, since I just added Super Sharp AI, I'm going to click on my Super Sharp AI in the extensions, and you have two different options here. There's always options, and that's a great feature with AI software and that's universal or motion blur. Universal is kind of just, the photo's kind of blurry. It's, that's just what it is. Or motion blur is if you're shaking your camera a little bit and you want to fix that. This one's just slightly out of focus. How it was at F16, I literally have no idea, but I've been there several times. I don't have to check on face enhancer because there's no human face in this, but if you are shooting humans, this would be available to you. So I'm just gonna keep this on universal and I'm going to click on the highest rated feature possible. So when I click on high, you see this really interesting screen come up that looks like it's analyzing your photo. Truth be told, I think this is just an entertaining feature to keep you busy while this is taking forever to sharpen your image because it takes literally forever. But I did in fact sit here and move the mouse around so that all these cool little lines would dance around like star constellations. So kudos to you, Luminar, for being able to do that and keep me entertained while this takes forever to update. Other things you can do while this updates, check your phone notifications. Hey, you can probably even do your taxes and how long this takes, but it does do a pretty good job. So now that it's finally done, let's look at the results here. It looks pretty good. I mean, similar probably to you if you're just looking at, at it on this video on YouTube, but zooming in, you can actually see that it is a pretty good update to what it was. So if I zoom in to 100%, from what it was, it's actually much, much sharper. Up to about 300% even, you can see some distinct edges and ridges. So this has done a fantastic job. If I actually put these two photos side by side for you to see and compare as they're really zoomed in, you can see the upgrade that SuperSharp AI did on this photo. And if you already have Luminar Neo, you can easily just buy this extension. Again, the link is in the pinned comment and in the video description, but this is a fantastic way for you to quickly and easily revive those old photos that are just taking up space in your memory and haunting you every single time you open your computer and look at it in that file. So I hope this really helped you. Here's another video about Luminar that I think is really going to help your photography too.